$7 million expansion would allow more families to enjoy a day of fun at the Marbles Kids Museum in downtown Raleigh. The museum is working on a makeover of its campus downtown while exploring plans to open new locations across Wake County. WRL's Matt Tallhelm is live in Raleigh to show us the plans. Matt. Yeah, Gerald, think of this location downtown as the hub, and then those spokes would go out from that throughout Wake County to those new locations that the museum is looking at doing. All of this would add to capacity here. It would allow 500 more kids and their caregivers to go through the doors here every day. A day off school meant a trip to Marbles Kids Museum for these two and their nanny, Brenda Graham. The disappointment of the day came when they found out the museum is closed on Mondays. We haven't been here in a long time because as they grow older, the, the exhibits are not as great. Graham is glad a refresh is in the works for the 15-year-old museum. What do you think of that plan to, to do some changes here? I think that would be wonderful. I think it would be wonderful. Plus, you know, like, um, I think that they need to expand the museum. Marbles is looking to make over its campus across from Moore Square in downtown Raleigh. We want to respond to the community who is always used to seeing us do more, and we want to have fun. And these ideas are really, really fun. The museum wants to renovate its central courtyard on Hargett Street with climbing structures, green space, and interactive art. Around the corner on Blunt Street, the Tree Tunes Courtyard would transform into a new two-story exhibit featuring a future workforce play area where kids can get hands-on experience exploring the skilled trades. And this area is growing so quickly and there's so many incredible jobs coming online. We want families to be able to play around with what those jobs might look like in really fun ways. Marbles is also looking to grow its footprint beyond downtown. A feasibility study would look at where the museum could add new, smaller locations in communities throughout Wake County. If we can reduce barriers by being in communities where we can thrive and they can thrive, it's just we're, we're meeting people where they are. The total project would cost a little more than $7 million. The museum is asking Wake County commissioners to pay for about half of that. It makes all the sense to be able to support this effort, this initiative, and continue to keep marbles as good as it is and make it even better. The other half of that cost would come from private fundraising. Today, Wake County commissioners gave their support and endorsement for this expansion and looking at ways to provide half of the funding from this uh, from the county for this project. All of this, the timeline is looking at about three years to get it done. And Marbles is also looking to launch a new program that would be for first time parents. It would provide them with free membership to the museum. You know, Marbles was always the, one of the coolest places in town for children already, Matt. This is going to make it that much more special. Thanks.